every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Tell them Hello, you guys, and welcome back to another video. It is currently Saturday, and we have a lot of errands to run. So I figured we gotta do this together, and I brought my little book because... I have a bad memory, so I write everything down. So let's go over everything that I want to accomplish today. I find that whenever I record, I get more things done than if I weren't going to record because it, I can't explain it. I, I can't explain it. It just, I feel more accomplished. All right, so uh, this is not going to be in order, by the way. I need to go pick up a box from Half Price Boxes. I just learned yesterday that you can buy boxes for half the price now remember i told you guys don't ever buy boxes but this box is different i need to return the desk so the desk that i bought i am returning it because it's too big for the space but the one of the sides of the desk it's really 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 tall and i can't find a free box that's that tall so i'm gonna have to buy the box so i have the dimensions of the table and all that so i'm gonna go to have price boxes and fingers crossed that it's a good price box and i can just get that box and return the stuff and get my money back and get on the process of buying a new desk then i need to go to walmart to get just one flower am i just gonna get one flower and that's it debatable i just need to get one flower because i'm growing tomatoes and bell peppers and whenever they start growing bugs and insects are going to be interested in it so i'm going to get this one flower that repels these in insects by the smell of the flower we shall see whenever we get to walmart so i can get more in depth of the what flower it is then i need to go to dollar tree to get some stuff for the plants now again am i going to dollar tree just to get some stuff just for the plants no i'm gonna definitely be looking around dollar tree it's been a while since i've been so definitely gonna get a couple things i need to wash my car um, so I'll probably do that after Walmart. I need to wash my car and vacuum it as well. And then I need to... I want to go to TJ Maxx and maybe Home Goods. It just depends. Oh, and then I need to rent the rug doctor. And I guess if I get the desk, if I get the box for the desk today, then I can go ahead and return that stuff today as well. It sounds like we have a lot. Uh, that will take a couple hours. And... You guys should be proud of me. It is currently 10 o'clock. I got up at 9 in the morning, guys. You probably don't know, but I sleep in pretty late on the weekends. I'm talking 12, 1 p.m. So for me to be up this early, got my makeup done, everything, and I'm in the car at 10, I'm proud of myself. So let's stop talking because the reason why I wanted to get up is so I could beat the traffic and beat everybody else on the weekend. So let's go. All right, y'all, I made it to half price boxes, and I thought about something on the way here. We're going to do the car wash and walmart last because i don't want to do other stuff and then let my plants sit here in the car that's that's the equivalent of leaving a dog here in a car with no windows down and no water and just here in the heat no can't do that all right guys i just got here and there's only one worker and he's talking to somebody else so i'm gonna try to look for this myself Got my handy dandy thing to measure the box. None of these look long, they just look wide, which is a problem. Oh God. These are all just wide, guys. Ooh. Just wide. I mean, maybe something like here, but this is very thick. I don't know. Okay. Nope. Oh my god. I found this box by the entrance. This works wide but long. It needs to be longer because you have to keep in mind you're going to fold that. So it needs to be way longer than that. So I don't know. Alright, I got my box. As you guys can see, it's huge, guys. It's bigger than the dimensions that I had, but honestly, I'm so tired of looking for this box. I want to get it over with. The box that I'm looking for is impossible to find, so I'm getting one bigger, but it's not too, too much bigger. Let me put it that way. And then with Amazon returns, they don't really care how big the box is as long as you return it. So that's... I'm done. I'm done. And it was $20, but it's huge, guys. It's huge. I just want to get it over with. I'm, I'm tired of that furniture sitting in my living room i'm just tired the guy in there was super super sweet he put the box in here he was really really sweet so if you guys ever want to find some good boxes at a good price go to half price boxes i know it's a weird angle but 
All right, let me check that off the list. Ah, this is the first quote quote book slash journal that I've ever actually wrote things in consistently. All right, so we did, we got the box. Now I need to return the stuff. So we have to go home for that. So we'll do that later. All right, we're gonna go to Home Goods next. And then hopefully Dollar Tree. All right, guys, made it to Home Goods. And look how peaceful it is at 10 o'clock in the morning. I love this. I might start waking up early on the weekend, so this is what it means. Looking at the Halloween stuff. Look at these plants. Ah, oh, so cute. Happy Halloween. Oh, oh my God. Guys, I love the little demon one with the horns. Oh my God. I like this skull too. The details. Ooh, look at this wreath hanger, y'all. Ooh, how much is this? Five, six dollars. Wow, that's cute. No luck at home goods, but it was starting to get a little crowded in there, so I left. I just mm. looks like this home goods hasn't really fully started with the Halloween decor. So, all right, next stop is Dollar Tree. We might stop at Starbucks, guys, because it's hot and I barely had anything for breakfast, so we might get some food too. I don't know, it just depends. Made it to Dollar Tree. Backpack is cute. Oh, look, they got signs. Kindness starts here. Character construction soda. <laughs> okay. If you guys ever need affordable hooks, here is the place to go. They have a lot of back to school supplies. Oh, now this is cute. I like that. Construction paper, you name it, they got it. I won't be going to every single aisle because I do want to do a Dollar Tree video soon. So, oh, this is cute. Yeah, a lot of back to school cute stuff. Oh, look, Ioni nails. I might get some nail art tweezers. Okay. These aren't horrible, but they're just so long, y'all. They're so long. Maybe I should get some lashes. I, I'm not a fan of lashes, guys. I don't know. I'm gonna skip on that. I'm probably never gonna wear them. They do have a lot of cute stuff. I can see why people like this brand. Very cute. And the fact that they're in Dollar Tree, we love that. I don't know, I don't even know where to start with lashes, guys. Ooh, these desk organizers, they have different colors. Okay, they started putting some Halloween stuff, so let's see what we can find. A tree, if you wanna do a Halloween tree, that's cute. Oh, what is this? What does this do? I don't know what it does. But it's cute, those three ghosts right there. Some DIYs for you. What is this? LED projector light, ooh. And look, that's what it should look like, that light right there, very nice. Okay, I like this sign that says home, very cute. Hang it over your door, cute. 
This little recipe sign is also very cute. I have a lot of pumpkins, different types of patterns. As you guys can see, different colors, fluffy, hard, you name it. I've always liked these little ones. Every year I always get some of these, these sparkle ones, but I have enough. Oh look, to hang on your door. They have this and brown. We've made it to the gardening section. The reason why I came, uh -huh. Okay, we have these plant labels, you get 10. So I am going to get these plant labels. What else do they have? Figurines, figurines, gnomes. What is this, flower pot hanger? Oh, that's so cute. Garden flag, I'm not into the garden flags, but just wanted to show you guys. They have potting soil right there, so you don't have to break the bank to start gardening. Wildflower blend shade area. I hope this isn't the only gardening section because I need more stuff. Oh, we got this. I guess I can get this. Nah, I don't know what to do with this just yet, so we're gonna hold up on that. Maybe some gloves? Some gardening gloves? I don't know. We'll hold off on that as well. I'm trying to look for the water, like the water feeder. I can't explain it. Ooh, Dollar Tree Plus. I like this. I like honestly all of them. They're really cute, but this one is really really cute got some small pumpkins for decor i like this one this one right here is so pretty oh look here are the pumpkins i like with different sizes let's look at the plus section this is dollar tree plus so this is more than a dollar and 25 got some leaf lights okay got those pumpkins dotted pumpkins right there oh happy fall y'all Oh, this is so cute. These are cute. These are $5, y'all. All right, okay. Different colors. I love the blue one and the green one right there. Oh my goodness. Here are some summer signs. Inflatable things, inflatable pumpkins. Okay. I like these lights, these purple lights. Ooh, spooky. This is really cute. And then you have different colors. There is the golden one. Here is the colorful one. I really like the colorful one. That one is pretty unique. This sign is so cute. Ooh, you can do a spider web tray. What? For $5? That's good. A cauldron. Hocus Pocus. Nice. I believe we found another area of gardening or so. Got these little rocks right there. Okay, okay. Vases. They always have some good vases here. I'm pretty sure this is where my mom got me this because I have the exact same one in blue. Ooh, I did not know they sold levels. So when you're hanging up arts or whatever, this, all this indicates that it's straight. Might as well get some of these to clean the car later. Wow, they have Mr. Clean. I didn't know that. All right, don't ask me how, but I ended up at Goodwill, which is nearby Dollar Tree. So hopefully we find something good. Honestly, I was not able to find anything at Goodwill's. Every time I go there, I go in hopes to find something unique, like I see on TikTok. But I honestly, I'm not good with thrifting, guys. I'm not good with thrifting. I don't have the patience for it, and I never come out with anything. And honestly, sometimes it smells really bad in there. And then the prices are starting to be a little high. All right, guys, real quick, I stopped to get some food at Tacos. I don't know. I'll tell you guys later because I don't want to get copyrighted. But I just have to get some food because I'm hungry. This place was called Tacos del Julio and it was actually pretty random and I love that. I like just randomly eating somewhere. I have always seen this taco place. So I was like, hey, might as well try it. I'm nearby it, so why not? And I will say it did not disappoint. But what, what was really disappointing was the proportions. Do y'all see that lime and cilantro like for four tacos? What? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> like, no, I need a lot. I need a lot, a lot. And then the side of beans, I don't know. I felt like it wasn't really a side. But you guys will hear me give you guys comments here on what I thought about a little later. But I will say, maybe I was hungry. Nah, nah, nah. It was really good. It was really good. I won't lie. All right, so bam, just ate some good food. I will say, though, it's called Tacos del Julio. It's really, really good. I won't lie. But I feel for the price, which is 13 something. That side of beans... Would we even consider that a side? I mean, I'm sorry, it was so small. If I get four tacos, what am I gonna do with two limes and a sprinkle of cilantro and a sprinkle of onions? Like, come on now, come on now. 
don't be stingy with the cilantro and the limes, please. Especially the limes and the cilantro. Everything. Don't be stingy with everything, please. I like it, but for that reason, mm, I don't know. And then I don't know if it was because it's a to-go order. I will tell you guys, whenever you order anything to go, you will always get a smaller proportion than you would if you were to sit down. That's a fact. Just letting you guys know it is good, but a little pricey and not enough proportions, I feel. Now we are going to go to Blue Wave, which is where I like to wash my car and vacuum it there as well. And then go to Walmart. And then I think I'm going to go home after that because I have avocados in the car and I don't want them to go bad. So I got the car washed, but it was so funny. I don't know if you guys have ever done a car wash, but before you get inside of the car wash thing, somebody guides you to tell you how to straighten up to follow that thing so it takes you neutral and it takes you. Guys, I suck at that. I suck so bad. And the guy saw my struggle and he was like, you did good. Don't lie to me, man. Do not lie to me. <laughs> but yeah, we got it done. Um, right now I am at the little vacuum section area, so I'm gonna do that. It's too hot guys, it's too hot. So I was gonna get the disinfecting wipes that I bought at Dollar Tree and clean the car inside, but honestly, that's gonna have to wait because it's too hot, it's too hot. I don't care if it's inside the car, it's too hot. This is what it looks like after cleaned the best I could. Let's go to Walmart. All right, made it to Walmart at the outdoor section. These are so cute, these white ones. All right, I'm at the outdoor section. These are on sale. I'm not looking to get any pots, but I'm just looking. $18, that's taxed. I don't know what clearance they be talking about. A lot of soils. I'm looking for the specific plant. It's called Marigold. Lantana, Lantana. These lantanas are on clearance though for $2. Oh. Okay, I don't see them. I might, I'm just gonna have to look for the seed to plant it myself. A lot on sale for $3. They got some outdoor rugs, y'all. Ooh, this one's cute. These pillows are all on clearance. This is really cute. Now I'm inside of Walmart where there's air. Oh, can be used as a planter. It's just a candle with thyme, okay. All right, it just provides a good scent outside. Who has the ox at Walmart? This is one. This is a Spanish song. Okay, again, lots of clearance. The, these are a dollar. Make sure that if you get, if you decide to grow plants, make sure that it has a hole. If not, drill one in the bottom of it. God, these are so cute. Y'all see the pattern on that one? That's so cute. But it's $22. I don't consider that a sale. Since y'all love Hello Kitty so much, come get your Hello Kitty full sheets here. Okay, you get one fitted sheet, one flat sheet, and two pillowcases. Okay? That she's up before somebody else does. She got cheetah print. I said we were going home. Technically, this is on the way home. So, technically, I didn't lie. We're at another home group. That one's so cute. You know, I'm always intrigued by the mugs and the Disney finds. 
But guess what I found? I'm glad I didn't go home because you guys will see what I found. Hello Kitty! Oh my god! Michael's is next to Home Goods, so don't look at me that way, okay? Don't judge me. I saw these last year, I believe. Oh, so cute. Look at their little boots. And that one, a classic black. And oh, that's cute though. It's very cute. What are these called? Garlands? I'm not sure, but there's a bunch of these. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. Oh my god, I love these stacked pumpkins. I might get a stacked pumpkin this year for outdoors. Fluffy pumpkins. Okay, okay. Oh, look at this little stand. I have a lot of good decor for Halloween. I like this one right here. This is actually really cute. That is so cute. Oh my god. Dang, they are making out. As promised, quick Starbucks run. Coffee secured. Okay, guys. Finally home, and this is everything I got. From Dollar Tree, I got some napkins because I don't have any napkins for $1.25. I saw this at checkout. Y'all know at checkout, you just be eyeing things, waiting for your turn. And I was like, hey, let me try this and see if it works. It's called a shoe eraser. So we will test these out if I can remember. Then I got this Sure Sense. I used to have these a lot when I was little. And you can really like reproduce these or use this forever as i remember but they lose their smells so this one is the one that smelled good the rest i'm not gonna lie smelled bad then i got these bowl fresh guys i haven't got these in a while every time i go to walmart they're too expensive and tur i mean and dollar tree for the win so i got three i got two reds and a yellow i'm not sure what color smells what i really don't see a difference i just know it smells good so then I got these wipes for the car, so I should put them in the car. And last but not least, the main reason why I went there, I didn't get everything that I needed for my plants, but at least I got these, these plant labelers. So this is just to stick it in the soil and label it what the plant is when I started planting them. I didn't really record. This is the last one because I went to, so technically the last stop before we got home. I didn't record too much because there was a lot going on, so but guess what I found. What? Look at the details, y'all. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I got three plates, but here's the catch. So I got two of these plates right here, one of this plate. I don't love this plate, so that's why I only got one. And this is what the patterns look like on the sides. Of course, I'm gonna wash them first, and yeah, that is all I got. Surprisingly, I'm proud of myself because I went to a lot of stores and didn't get anything. So, Dollar Tree and Home Goods. It's good. And I actually want to show you guys a little, I want to say stash, like a little pile that I'm building up for my Halloween decor, which is coming very soon. So stay tuned for that. So this is not Halloween related, but you can actually get a big Lego. Eight, I think it's like an eight storage thing, as you guys can see, for $25 at Home Goods or TJ Maxx compared to $40 at the Lego store. And then I finally got the spooky rug. I've been wanting this rug. Last year I was going crazy finding it. And I guess this year everybody's focused on Hello Kitty that nobody cares about this rug anymore. So and then I got this table runner and it lights up in dark. Y'all see the little green? Yes. It's so cute, I like it. So I'm excited for Halloween, y'all. I'm gonna start very soon, so like I said, stay tuned for that. 